<laughs> Ifo is elder sister, yeah. right? And then the younger one, Ichupu. <laughs> Welcome and welcome back to Luna Yogini Channel! Why am I so happy? I'm happy because she's here. As you can see, my friend is back! Belina is here! Let me come down. So Belina is back and I have I have some questions for her because I feel like when I read your comments or many people DM me on Instagram, like how do you get to Korea to study? So she is here doing her PhD. So I thought she might have some tips for you guys. Mm. So okay, Belina, do you have anything to say to our viewers? Like maybe you can just share like how you came to Korea and some tips for them to also come to Korea. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be shy. Okay. So um, I think it depends. There are like numerous scholarships. Mm. There are GKS, like KJSP, the Korean government scholarship, mm. and there are POSCO, Samsung. Um, then the university scholarships. Mm. Um, there are a couple of scholarships. Okay. You just have to know what you want to do, mm. and then like, like for for instance, like for PhD, like we write proposals, mm, 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 mm. and then the university funds, okay. or you also get like there are different scholarships. There are people who come from GKS mm. or like even POSCO or like some other scholarships. Mm. Um, but usually, I think like for engineering, um, the university there are a couple of scholarships that the university provides. Mm. Um, my scholarship You're is also that, like, right? yeah, university mm. provides. And yeah, I think um, you need to find what you want to do mm. and then uh, select the university like that gives you that um, kind of like your interest area. Mm. And then also like I feel like people have a misconception that in order to study in Korea you need to know Korean. Mm. But there are certain departments that teach everything in English. Mm. So you need to also like you need to do a lot of your own research. research like right? yeah. however you use internet, you mm. need to like Google and find out like because a lot of people yeah. don't put an effort to like find out because mm -hmm. everything is in Google. Like mm. you know you just need to find True. out and put a little True. bit more effort mm -hmm. because honestly I also did it everything myself. And mm. A lot of people must have done like things by themselves. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Mm. Um, yeah, I think interest area is important mm -hmm. and the university that you want to study, like mm. you, maybe you can just like select a few universities you want to study and okay. then check their departments and see because they will mention whether they teach in English or Korean. Mm. But for also like for KGSP, like Korean Government Scholarship, mm -mm. they give you like a year where you learn Korean. Like so even, a language course mm, for a year. Mm, for a mm. year, like they pay for it. So, so I have a question, mm. like I heard that you need to give like the topic test to prove your Korean proficiency while applying in Korean universities like level mm. 3 or something mm. level 3 so or it four? depends that's why like, oh it depends, depends on, on the subject, yeah, and, the the subject and the university mm. like for example my I, I do international studies mm -hmm. so everything is taught in English oh. so I don't really require mm -hmm. to study Korean mm. but yes the university provides an option for me to learn Korean, mm -hmm. so I, I am learning, but also like it's not a compulsory. Yeah, because, but it's very convenient to yeah, you know learn, Korean, right? Yeah, because, because if you are in a foreign mm -hmm. country, I mean, also it's a good opportunity to learn language, and I love learning language. Sure. But sure. also just just to let you know, like mm -hmm. you know, like a lot of people, I feel like have this misconception that in order to study Korea, like you know, you have to you learn. Have to learn. Korean, so you yeah. don't really. I mean, it really depends on the department. Mm. Um, there courses that give you everything in English okay um, mm. but of course like there are Korean centric courses mm. but now I feel like most of the top universities mm -hmm. in Korea like for example um, uh, Yonsei Korea University the Sky like, right yeah Sky <laughs> Iwa like yeah. my university yeah. like, all of the Ivy League uh, mm. universities in Korea mm -hmm. or even like in general like the national universities in Korea mm -hmm. or some regional universities also actually provide like department like where you know it's taught in English mm -hmm. so it really depends like mm -hmm. you have to be able to like find out yourself from the university because the university website has everything mm -hmm. and also like you can always email them mm -hmm. you know and also yeah one more way of getting scholarship is work working with your professor like, oh. um, so if you like research, mm -mm. like if you're from research background, um, you write to professors mm -mm. who are in your similar work, mm -mm. like doing similar work of your interest area, mm -mm. and then you mail them and the professors usually 
um, usually in foreign universities, even in India actually, it's the same. Mm-hmm. But a lot of people don't know. But mm-hmm. that's how it works. And um, in research, especially, mm-hmm. like you email the professor who, for example, if I like uh, say learning about Korean culture, and yeah. there's professor who has worked in Korean culture. Mm-hmm. They will have a lot of research fundings, mm. so they're allowed to take students under them, and they from pay from abroad, mm. Mm. and they pay for you. Mm. So your tuitions, your uh, pocket money, like you get a stipend. Oh. Your tuitions are paid for, and your dorm are paid for. So, mm-hmm. but you basically have to work alongside the professor mm. for your edu- entire like education. Like for example, if you're doing masters mm-hmm. or if you're doing PhD. So that's one way, oh. and then the university has a lot of like fundings for you know research. Um, yeah, I think almost all the universities have funding, mm-hmm. so you have to be able to search it. Yeah. yeah. So the essence is do your own research work, but then again, she has shared so much of information which is like going over my head. <laughs> but I hope it helps you out because that's the point yeah. of this session. And moving on to the next session, I am going to learn some. Sema <laughs> language, yes. Your tribal languages, even in one state, mm. they're so different from one another. Yeah, it, yeah, there yeah. are no similarities. I've myself. seen like Ao and Sema. Mm. It's, it's very different. Yeah. We don't understand each other at all. Mm. We don't understand yeah, each other. that's why you have Nagamis, right? But today we are going to focus on Sema. But why do you have Sema and Sumi? <laughs> I mean, why do you have two names for your tribe? Sema, Sema and Sumi is basically the same. Same, right? Yeah. yeah. But which one do you prefer using? Sema. Yeah, usually we use Sema, Sema yeah. more than. So me, okay. Yeah. I've seen them write in both, mm. so I was like, okay, mm. like I wanted to ask. Okay, what, 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 okay. <laughs> okay, so yeah, you have to start the session because I don't know any. Before I begin, Muga, I miss you so much. Muga is my Naga brother who is also Sema, and uh, honestly, I didn't really get to learn a lot of Sema from him. I, actually, I, I didn't learn anything from him. He kind of trained me how to speak in Nagamese more than in Sema because he thought that would be more helpful for me to communicate with all the Nagas. So thank you, Muga. I miss talking to you in broken Nagamese. <laughs> that will happen very soon when I'm back to India. And now let's move on with Bilina's Sema language class. Okay. What do you want to know? I mean, like, like the basics, of course. <laughs> okay. You know, I studied like for the longest time. I studied outside, mm. so I think I'm my sema is like horrible. Like kind of broken. <laughs> I mean, I I speak sema with my parents. But, but like, you are actually half sema, right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm half sema, half ao, and half carby. Like my father wow. is half carby and half ao. Which makes me Carby technically, uh-huh. but because I live all my life in, because I was born and brought up in Nagaland and we live in Dimapur, there. Right? Yeah, Dimapur. Uh-huh. A mix of so many <laughs> tribes makes a genius. So I'm not I'm, a genius. I have a genius right next to me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, she. I really, really want to say this out loud. She is not only intellectual. She is funny. <laughs> she is weird. She's strange. <laughs> she's cute and she's sexy and she's everything. I mean, come on, that's called a genius, okay. right? <laughs> <laughs> what is tanga tanga? Tava tava. Oh, tava tava. Stop. Like, that's it. Kind okay. of thing. Tava tava. Tava tava. Oh, tava tava. Tava tava. I'm learning. See? Tava tava. Kushanye. Tava tava. Kushanye. I'm happy. Kushanye. Okay, I'll guess the meaning. Kushanye means that makes you happy. <laughs> Kushanye. Kushanye. How are you? <laughs> Okay, Kushanye, what's your name? <laughs> Kushanye! 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 Like, Kushanye! Where? What? Kushanye! Like, Kushanye! No, what's Kushanye! Up? Oh! What's up? Oh, oh, really? What are you doing? Ah, what are you doing? Mm. Kushanye! Uh, Kushanye! 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 Kushanye is actually like, how are you? Oh, yeah. it's Kushanye. like just Kushanye and Kushanye. Kushanye. Kishiane, oh, like, Kishiane, like, or like, are you fine? Like, uh-uh. it's very like, how do I say? It? It's it's a very like informal way of saying. Like, okay. Alanya mo, like, are you doing well? Ah, uh, Alanya mo. Kishiane or how? Kishiane is more like, how are you? Ah, uh, and Alanya mo means like, are you, are you I doing well? You are doing well. Oh, okay, okay. Kishiane and Kishiane, <laughs> and Alanya, Kishiane. 
And then how do video, I reply? Video, video, Lani. <laughs> video, Lani. <laughs> Why is it so hard? My tongue is not as flexible as oh, it was okay, before. Okay, Kishani. Kishani. Kishani means how are you? Okay. Alani. Alani means I'm fine. Alani. Kishani. Alani. Kishani. Alani. Ask me. Kishani. Alani. Oh, this is so cute. I love this tone. Alani. <laughs> Alani. Oh, I'm so <laughs> Yeah, I am extra all the time. So that's mm. me. Oh, I wanted to ask, is this like uh, the informal way of asking a friend or I can say this to an elderly person as well? I mean, or do I, you have that have differentiation? Differenti I don't think so. We have like a differentiation. Oh, really? There is no tui yeah. and up in Sema. You you can say yeah. that to your granddad also. Like yeah, that. yeah. Oh, then but there. I mean, I guess. Um, mm. of course, like we say, like we obviously we're not gonna say it directly. We address like ani, ang like uncle, auntie, ah, ah, like, ah like, you add mm. the auntie and uncle, and it becomes formal kind of. Thing. Yeah, I mean, like you are respecting already mm. by calling that. Ah, so yeah. I don't think so. We have like a formal like in Korea, you have a hierarchy of like yeah, yeah. Like, how to speak to your boss, how mm -hmm. to speak to your friend, and then how to speak to a, like a royal status. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. very different, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. But I don't think so we have like that kind mm -hmm. of thing. Yeah. That, that, that is more like English mm -hmm. then. Yeah, in Nagamis, it's like Toi Moi is also like a little bit like the, the respect. Informal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah like Apnees, yeah, like yeah, more apnees. elderly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But in, in Sema, I don't think so we really mm -hmm. have that. Okay, okay, then uh, you just said un uncle, auntie, how do you say that? Like, like for example, if it's like my immediate, like my mom's brother, yeah, Ingu is means like my uncle, like oh, kind Ingo. of thing, Ingu. Okay. But if, for example, it's my mom's friend, yeah, then I will be Ango. Ango, or a little like, bit like yeah, okay, you're... or or like a relative, mm -mm. like Ango. And it's immediate that E, yeah, e. like okay. my sisters, uh -huh. I'll call them like Ifo, Ifo. Like yeah. whether younger or elder, no, it's both Ifo. elder is Ifo. Oh, elder is Ifo, mm. and younger? It's Inpu, like my younger sister. She's it's like, Inpu. Yeah, like so cute. Oh it's like God. I don't know, like younger sister. I don't know if it like really means, but it, it's in It's more like a my sister, like an adoring way to call your okay, younger sister. Yeah, I think it's in but it sounds very uh, okay. Adorable. All the semas, don't kill me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so bad yeah. at explaining. I mean, like, please don't judge her based on this video. I don't, I don't like judgments, please. No, I don't want to offend because also like. You know, like it's a language, yeah, yeah, and it's you need. A language, I, yeah. I, yeah, here we both respect languages. We yeah. love languages. Yeah. So here we are just trying to explore mm. and learn. So yeah. Okay, before I go. Oh, I saw on mm. your post mm. about your parents. Mm. Ira and Isa, Isa. Oh, Isa. Isa is like my mother. Isa. And then I call my mom's um, sisters Aza. Like Asa. My young mom's younger sister. Like Asa, aunties. Yeah. Not your... auntie, like we uh, younger mother, elder mother. Like oh, it's like Like in Korea we also have Kunamma, Taganamma. Oh yeah. Kunamma yeah, yeah. is Isa and younger one, Taganamma is Aza. Yeah. I mean it's technically like my mom's sisters ah. are also like in relation they're also my mother. Mm -mm -mm. But like my own, not my own immediate. mother, yeah. yeah so my own uh, mother Isa, mm. and then like my like my mom's sisters, I call them Aza. Aza. Mm. Ah. Yeah. When I say Isa, like to my mom, mm -mm. if I feel like that's like mm. makes me feel closer, like, like I call my dad Ipu, mm. Ipu, Ipu Isa. Why is it so cute? Everything is so cute. I'm not Isa, Ipu. <laughs> okay, Ipu. Yeah, Ipu. Ipu Isa and Isa. Um, and how do you say I love you? Nye no kimechi. Why is it so long? Wait. Nye no kimechi. Nye no kimechi. Chini. 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 Oh, Chini. Nye no kimechi. Nye no kimechi. Chini. Nye no kimechi. Nye. Oh. I'll tell my mom. Iza, nye no kimechi. Ani and ango, nye no kimechi. I love you from Korea and I love your daughter so much. I will make sure that she's happy and keep her happy. Where are you going? Kilo chine. Kilo chine. 
chin yeah everything is a bit near in mm. uh, Sema, right that's what I'm noticing because in our I notice a lot of murder mm. like something like that ours more like in yeah like I think ours is like we use even in the names mm -mm. we use very Li Ka uh, like in names like for example my friend's name is Mugaka Su Ka Mugaka Oh Ka uh, Oh yeah Motoka Oh <laughs> Kitoka <laughs> <laughs> then if you say Lee, then it becomes girl. Girl, like, okay. Mugakali. Ah, Mugakali. I heard Kita this. Kitokali. Ah. Uh, like yeah. Like but you're my not, sisters. You're not Bilina. Well, no, Bilina <laughs> Lee. <laughs> Bili, my like Bilina is also like a Sema name. Mm. And then like my sister's name is Bokali. Oh, Bokali. Yeah. Lee. Okay. Yeah. So. My mom is Lee Jangi. No, Jangi Lee. <laughs> Okay, girl, you're Sema! My mom is Sema, oh my god! Should answer. I'm going home. Eklojin. Eklojin. Akila. Akila. Ucheni. Ucheni. Mm. But when you say it fast, it's like. Aklo yeah, I speak fast. I speak really fast. Ah. It's like Eklojin. <laughs> Do it again. Akilo. Akila Ucheni. Akilo. Akila. Oh, Akila Ucheni. Ucheni. Akila Ucheni. Aklo Cheni. No, Aklo. Akilo. Akilo Cheni. What? What did you say? Anacho Chumpe. Anacho Chumpe. Go home now. Anacho Chumpe. No. Then? It's 8.30. Did you eat food or not? Yes. <laughs> what the hell? Now she's breaking me. If I put the action like this, obviously you're going to know you're not like stupid. Or are you? Are you? I am slow. Okay. I'm not stupid. I'm slow. <laughs> okay. Eklo chumpe. Anacho chumpe. Anacho chumpe. I was trying to say like it's 8.30. Did you eat food or not? Oh. I thought you would understand because we didn't eat food yet. And oh. we have to order. Oh, yeah. We have to order. So we have to end this video actually. Like we're hungry. Yeah. And we might not get food. What? Eklo chumpe. Anacho chumpe. Anacho chumpe. Anacho chumpe. What does anacho mean? And Ana means rice. Ah. So in Nagaland, I think people ask, did you have rice or not? It's like, did you have meal or not? But kaishe ya Like, right? Yes. Yeah, so smart. I think that is also part of your culture, right? To ask. Because we eat rice. Yeah. <laughs> it's a uh, food, like. Yeah. Koreans. Even for Koreans. Korean. Oh yeah, yeah pam yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Korean Nagaland. See one similarity we found. Anacho chumpe. Usually in in like in Hindi, kana it's yeah, kana. So kana. kana means food. Food. Yeah. It's not really rice. Mm -hmm. Because it's not a state. But in like. But in Bengal we say pat kecho na kauni. It's like bhat kaise ya kanai. Mm. Similar. Yeah? It's similar. Bengali Nagamese and Assamese. It's, so it's, it's very like very similar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. For that, how do you answer? Chuba means I ate. Ah. Chumpi means I didn't eat. Oh, chuba, chumpi. Mm. Chumpi. Yeah, that means you didn't eat. Chumpi, I, I didn't eat. I'm getting angry now. I'm hungry. I really feel angry when I'm hungry. I really need. Now tell Iri Iri. <laughs> she really irritated of me so quickly, you know, guys. Yeah, she hates me, but I what? love her. Yeah. <laughs> see, see? Proof, proof. Anyways, okay. So, mm. I think we should end this video because we should. We are Anacho Chumpi. Mm. No, we are Chumpi right now. Chumpi. Ana Chumpi. Ana Chumpi right now, and we are very hungry. So, we. <laughs> I really. Paim Kutum Shiva. Like, Ado. 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 Ado Tova Ana Chingyu. I think it's now. Going home. <laughs> no, 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 Ado. Ado Tova. Ado Tova. Like, it's time for eating. Because Ado Tova! <laughs> chumpi! Ado Tova! Ado Tova! You look so psycho. I'm so sorry. Uh, if uh, no, uh, oh, Milena is Hilda and Ipu, don't worry. I'm not psycho. I might look like psycho, but I'm not, so don't worry. And Abilina's uh, what? Ichupu. <laughs> Younger sister. Ifo is elder sister. Yeah. Right? And then the younger one, Ichupu. <laughs> Something like that. It's a poop. <laughs>
Atsinpu means my sister. Yeah, so Milena is Ichinpu and Ifo, don't worry, I'm not psycho. Okay, that is the end of this vlog. I'm so bye. sorry if I... Guys, bye. <laughs> Just shut up. No, let me... This is my outro. My warriors of light, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope to see you in my next video. And if you want to see such more fun content, then... With my face. <laughs> Yeah, with her face, yeah. then don't forget to like this video, share this video, and subscribe to Yay. my channel! Okay, Bye. annyeong!